20 years almost since Middle of Nowhere uh -huh. came out. Yeah, yeah. When almost. you hear that statement, what goes through your mind? I usually think, wow, 20 years goes by fast. <laughs> <laughs> I think, wow, we're really stubborn. It just will not go away. Yeah. But I think, really, it just makes you feel proud to be able to still be looking out at happy people that are singing along. To be this far into a career and see your, your dreams realized, is, it kind of makes you smile. And in 20 years, will you guys still be doing this? You'll be, you'll be what, 50? I'll be 50. The great thing about creating music is that you're always creating things. I think as long as we're interested in it, as long as we're, you know, making music we're proud of and doing tours that we're enjoying, I think, mm -hmm. yeah, we'll be doing it. this beer line, you are making music all the time. You guys are one of the first artists to really go against the record labels sure. when the were happening. We just had to do something because the current system is broken. Do you feel like pioneers and innovators? I, I, I think I we feel like, like really, really like stubborn, uh, overly self-confident. Uh. I, <laughs> I think that we love the idea of being entrepreneurs. We love the idea of taking risks for the right reasons. Yeah. We want to find new ways to do things. You have to find a new way to reach people, a new way to say, uh, you know, simple things like "I love you" or "My life sucks." The new single from uh, Manson. My life sucks. <laughs> My life sucks. I love you. <laughs> we hope to be innovators, and if if you know people look at our career and look back at what we've done and say that about us, we feel proud. The question is, do you keep asking the bully to beat you up? No, you, you punch it back. I think a lot of artists, especially recently, have kind of followed in your guys' footsteps. You have Five Seconds of Summer, who just started their own label. You have Taylor Swift, who put out that letter mm -hmm. to Apple Music. Mm -hmm. I mean, what do you say to acts like that? Just like, you're oh. welcome? <laughs> it is very cool, and huge kudos to Taylor Swift for using her platform to make a point, as opposed to hide behind you know, being successful and being afraid that being that successful, you're gonna lose something. Because she has stuff to lose, mm -hmm. right? For us, we are happy to be a part of the story of how the music business has changed. It's really exciting to see people of all stripes choosing to look for alternative ways to reach fans because that's the thing that's not talked about enough is that you know the people that are hurt the most by, um, by an industry that's maybe not really thinking about the future of music is, is the, the audience.